Democrats are in hot pursuit of Trump's missing, but known, communications with Russian President Vladimir Putin, and as of Monday, three different committees in the House have now joined forces to try to retrieve them. News reports have indicated that there are records of conversations between President Trump and President Putin that Trump has purposefully had concealed or possibly even destroyed. House Democrats maintain that if those records do exist, then they would be protected under a Watergate era law. Democratic Representative Adam Schiff of California, chair of the House Intelligence Committee, joined with Rep. Elliot Engel of New York, chair of the House Committee on Foreign Affairs, and Rep. Elijah Cummings, chair of the House Oversight Committee, have sent letters formally requesting any internal documents that have information about meetings and phone calls between Trump and Putin. The letters, which requested that the information be given to them by March 15, were sent to Secretary of State Mike Pompeo and White House Chief of Staff Mick Mulvaney. The Washington Post dropped a bombshell with a January report stating that Donald Trump had gone to great lengths to conceal notes of a 2017 meeting with Putin in Germany and House Democrats have been on the trail ever since. Democrats claim that those records should have been protected by something called the Presidential Records Act and destroying them would be in direct violation of such.